On Thursday, it all begins right here on The Fan at the XL Energy Center. Colorado comes to town. The Wild open the season. 8 o'clock on this radio station. And of course, if it's hockey season, we have one expert on this show. Don't get me wrong, there's a lot of experts on this station and they're all good. But there's only one Jacques Lemaire. And Jacques joins us now. Good morning, good morning. guy. Oh, yes, guys. <laughs> yes. Listen to Here you. we go, guys. Oh, I can hear the excitement in your huh? voice. Buckle up, guys. Yeah. It's hockey time. Yeah. Yeah. Time to drop the puck, guys. No, I, let's play yeah, some hockey. Right, right, and 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 not know, tonight. Not tonight. We're going to start on Thursday. Okay, guys. that's fine. That's the first game. Yep, it is the first game. It, no, it is. Yeah, yeah, it's the first game against Colorado. Yeah, um, may I ask, uh, Jock? Uh, we haven't spoken to you in the off season because I know you're very busy. You d- vacation? Where did you go? Did you do anything fun? I went to Dallas, guys. Ooh. Went down to Dallas. I watched some film. I thought I had the bola, guys. You thought you had the bola. Thought I had the bola, no, but uh, you, yeah. oh, you thought you had tough. You thought you had an Ebola. Were Real you sitting a little under the weather or something? Is that what you were saying? No, I just thought I had it. You just like, oh, interesting. <laughs> no symptoms. No? Wishful thinking, guys. Oh, you wished that you'd had it. Really? Why? Why would you want that? Because I'm tough. You are tough. <laughs> you're a tough guy. Hockey players need to be tough. Right. I right. don't care if you're gonna take on a guy like Boogie. If you're gonna take on Bola, you just gotta take it down. I understand. Um, Stare it in the face and say, "Not this time, Bola." <laughs> that makes it's perfect sense to me. Uh, Jock, uh, Tenna B is here with us. He's our, Hi, Jock. Uh, Hi, B. Uh, he's our resident uh, hockey expert. He's got a couple <laughs> questions for you about this, the, the season itself. Go ahead, Tenna B. Yeah, Jock, I know uh, Mike Yo, the, the current head coach of the Minnesota Wild, isn't really revealing who he's going to start in, in, in between the pipes, that goalie on, on Thursday night. He's got two goalies, and Nicholas Backstrom and Darcy Kemper. And I know you've, in the in the past, have had success with uh, kind of rotating two goalies. You had Manny Fernandez and Dwayne Rolson on that playoff run. You also did uh, Fernandez and Backstrom. Uh, what's kind of, what, are you one of those guys where you'd rather have one main goalie, or do you like having the rotation? What's kind of your philosophy on, on goaltenders? I like guys who stop the puck. <laughs> but I also like guys who I can make songs up about. I used to sing this song in the locker room. It would go, Rolly the goalie. <laughs> And Manny didn't like that, and I'm like, well, Manny, you come up with a song for yourself. <laughs> you come up with a song, Manny, and then I'll put you in the game. <laughs> We're all in the goal. You got, you've got yeah. quite a voice there. Well, got... well, just to continue on the goaltending thing, how come Mike Yo is keeping it a seeker? What's, what's kind of the point and the purpose be- as a coach not letting the other team know or yeah. not letting the media know why, who, what goalie you're going to start? Hmm. Because it's the element of surprise. Oh, you gotta get somebody off guard. Oh, you gotta shoot the puck when they don't when they don't see it coming, and that's the same thing for a roster. Mm-hmm. Who's gonna be in goal? I don't know. Is it gonna be this guy? Mm. Is it gonna be that guy? Mm-hmm. Right. Is it gonna be the other guy? Sure. I don't know. Oh wow, mm. Jack, uh, Mike Yo is going with some younger right. players. Did you like to play younger players, or do you just kind of like to stick with the, the the guys that you knew the best? I liked anybody who played tough. Huh? Yeah, right. Who skated hard. Uh huh. And who had a name I could easily pronounce. Like who? I mean, who were you, some of your favorites? I mean, remind us. Let's take it back to the glory days. Yeah, I mean. Burns and Booch and Bruno. On this new wild roster, though, this new wild roster, guys, I've been watching a lot of film all summer. Oh. Mm. They got a lot of guys I like. L- like? Like Ballard. Mm, yeah. Like Blum. Oh, oh. I like this guy, Bickle. <laughs> Bickle. I like Brodziak. Oh, yes. Wow. Big fan of Brodine. Oh, mm. And Backy. Backy. <laughs> yeah, I wrote a song about Backstrom. Oh, I'd love to, may, uh, if you don't mind. How's it I... go? Broly the goalie. Guys, you know, what, the one thing I the one thing was... I keep hearing, though, guys. I'm confused. I thought that was about. You know, I'm, I'm just glad hockey's back. Hey, thanks, man. I'm so glad. Not you. <laughs> not you. I'm so glad that the sport of hockey's back, guys. The sports world needs hockey. I'm so tired of hearing all this garbage yeah. in other sports, right? You yeah. got a guy punching somebody in the face. Right. People are throwing people against walls. Right. Hockey players don't West stand walls? for that. Mm-mm. We don't stand for that. Don't punch people in the face. Don't throw people against walls. Right, right, right. Hey, uh, as Unless you... you're on the ice. Oh, now we're talking. Then punch away, throw away. We don't like that off the ice, guys. Right, right. That makes sense. 
Hey, Jacques, the Wild made a little bit of improvement last year getting into the second round of the playoffs. What do the Wild need to do in particular to become a Stanley Cup contender this year? Score more goals. That's mm. it. Boy. That's it. Score more Nailed goals. It. Nailed score it. Guy, no, score more goals and sign more guys that are from here. Like uh, Thomas Fanick. What do you know about Thomas Fanick? I know he's from here. Oh, <laughs> oh wow. You yeah. got to be from here. Yeah, that's good. Right. When I was the coach of the Wild, I remember I'd have fans you. come up to me and they'd say, Jacques. We're happy that Gabby's here, right? but he's not one of us. I don't know that guy. And I'd say, guys, 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 it's nice that you got a player from here or a player from there. Do we really care where they're from? And they would say, yes, they got to be from Minnesota. So what, what, what did I do? I, I, don't, what? I don't know. I, don't know. I hit the road, guys. Ooh. Ooh. Hit the road, guys, and I went to Blaine, <laughs> and I went to <laughs> Buffalo, guys, and Becker, and Byron, and Baxter. Right. And Bemidji and Big Lake and Breckenridge and Blue Earth and Bacchus and Bram and Butterfield and Barrett and Boyd and Breezy Point and Brooklyn Center and Bayport and Brooklyn Park wow. and Bloomington and Brainerd and Burnsville, guys. <laughs> and I said, find me a guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, right. That skates hard, that plays tough, that remember scores that? goals. Oh, God, I remember that. Oh. Hey, uh, I, you know, we, it's fun now to have you back on in hockey season again right around the corner. And uh, we'd love to have you come down to the X with us on Thursday, unless you're busy. I don't know if you have other things. Uh, we're gonna I'm watching film Thursday morning, Thursday getting morning. ready for the avalanche. I understand. Oh. Uh, but you realize, okay, yeah, yeah. never mind. Well, okay, no, I don't know. Really tough game, guys. That's going to be tough. Those I, guys those guys lost to us last year. They did, yes. But they, they're young. It was, it was fun, yes. But they're young and they're fast. Yes. Do you, uh, do you think you'll ever get back into coaching? Once a coach. Always. Yeah, what are you saying? Oh, saying, coach. I'm he's, coaching right now. He's, he's the coach. What are you coaching? I'm coaching that guy that just asked me the question. <laughs> <laughs> oh, see, that's, that's like a life Never, coach. Thank you. What's coach. your name, young man? Uh, Paul Lambert. Paul, Paul, what do you do for a living? Oh, that's a good question. I, I say weird things on the radio. Hmm. Oh, dear God. <laughs> yeah, right. I know. We feel the same <laughs> way. your job? Yeah. yeah, that's what he does. Do, so, you, do you try hard? No. Oh, jeez, guys. <laughs> Yeah, it's tough. Do you play tough? No. Mm. Oh, God. No, he doesn't. Do you score goals? Once in a, a while. Be honest. No. Only when he pulls the goalie. Yeah. I, I can pull the goalie, coach. I feel like you're trying to be funny there, guys. Yeah, see what he does. I feel like you're making a joke that I'm not getting. Right. Hey, uh, I, I still see you coaching Marion Gabrick on Twitter. Yeah, I follow Gabby on Twitter because he doesn't return my calls. Oh, no. Sometimes I call him and I tell him, I watch the team you're going to play next Tuesday and I want to give you some pointers, and he won't call me back. So now I just mm-hmm. I just RT him or I favor him or I tender him. Oh, right. brother. Sometimes I just do things like that. And, I uh, saw a nice picture like of him holding up his, uh, his Stanley Cup ring. Um, you won a few rings. Can, yes. can, the, can the Wild win a Stanley Cup this year? Without me as coach, no. Oh, that, I agree. Wow. Well, I, you know, I hate to say they're scoring that. too many goals. They're, yeah, they're gonna. We they're scoring way too many goals. Play defense, guys. I, yeah, we got to <laughs> stop the puck. Uh, you should probably give Marion a call. I uh, just call Gabby again, and uh, yeah. you know, just I call him all the time. I know. Try him again uh, because I know that you know he, he loves you. No, not now, now. Not, oh, Jock, I still have another question for you, Jock. Gabby. No, no, this no. is uh, the the power to morning show on the fan. Same so thing. You, you haven't hung oh, up. Oh, you got this. Gabby on the show. No, Ga- yeah, uh, yes, Gabby's right here. Go ahead, Gabby. Gabby, how are you doing, buddy? Go ahead. Thanks for finally oh, answering boy. my call. I'm great, Coach. How are you? Oh, my God, Gabby. <laughs> I'm doing great. I'm are bad. you excited for the hockey season, guys? Very excited for the hockey season. Did you see the picture I, on Twitter of me and my new ring? Yes, I follow you on the tweet. Absolutely. <laughs> you look very good. You look good. Thank you. Sorry to ever return your phone calls. Yeah, why? I don't know. I'm busy playing hockey. That a boy. <laughs> That's my busy. boy, Gabby. <laughs> Did you play start. hockey year round? I try to, yeah. Do you remember when you were here with the Wild and I was the coach and you were like, Coach, I want to play hockey all year round, but I can't. I'm going, of course you can. And then I told you my invention. Do you remember this? Yeah. And you were so amazed because what I had done, guys, what I did was I took a hockey skate and I put wheels on it uh, underneath <laughs> underneath the boot and then people were just blading all over the place oh my you invented that i did i don't think that's uh, true that was good gotta be rich game. yeah that, that, that's not right well I, listen gabby's gotta go so you want to say goodbye uh real quick to uh to gabby goodbye gabby bye coach give me back my rollerblades i'll be scoring goals for you
Give uh, me back those rollerblades. I want to say, uh, by the way, we're going to try to make this a regular get. We have a sponsor, um, and I know you're excited about this, uh, um, Coach. Uh, Jock Lamar appears courtesy of Bob's Brazilian Wax Boutique in Buffalo. The hell is that? <laughs> uh, they want a sample spot. Can you cut one yeah, for us? Uh, you, they said that you knew about this, Bob's Brazilian Wax. Yeah. No idea who Buffalo. those guys are. Well, they, do you know what a Brazilian Wax is? I don't know what that is, guys. I'm too busy watching film. So so listen to me, though, guys. Seriously, here's what I need somebody to do. Oh, okay. okay. I need somebody to fund this this project that I have called these rollerblades. <laughs> I think it's already done. Think, think about this, guys. Just tell me. Forget ice just for one okay. second. I'll fund it. Just tell him you'll do it. Gabby will fund it. Think about just skating your road. Yeah. On the ice, on the water, on That's, the roads, on the grass, you just oh my skate all day. Yeah, no, it sounds like a great <laughs> idea, and I think we'll all we'll we'll talk to you, um, and maybe we'll give you a call, uh, or you can call us after the show, and we'll talk about this. I think it's a great idea. No, show's still on though. Who's he calling? I, I think he's trying to call us right now. After the show. Coach, I think if Coach. you if you go to rollerblade dot com, you can see it's already he, taken. He's not going to do. He's still. Hello, guys. This is uh, uh, hello. Is this freecreditreport dot com? No. no. I'm, I'm, I think we should just let him go. Thanks, yeah. Coach. You guys, I, I swear I have good credit, guys. Just give me some money, and we're going to make these rollerblades <laughs> thing happen. You just just say bye. Uh, yeah, bye. Call us back. See ya. Hey, he's still he's still trying you to. You have to hang up the phone. <laughs> He probably thinks he's on hold with them. Hang with up the, the music. Phone, Jock. Yeah, he, I think he thinks he's on hold. Coach. Pretend you're Bob's Coach. Brazilian wax. Rolling a goalie. Coach. Rolling a goalie. Coach. Rolling a goalie. Coach. I think he might have had. I'm just going to pot him down. We got a good break. Yeah. Bye, Coach. He's still singing. He's still singing. He's still singing. Not a bad voice. Tell him you're Bob's Brazilian wax boutique. Coach. Hello, guys. Hi, this is Bob's <laughs> Brazilian wax boutique in Buffalo. I have. Something that's going to blow your mind, guys. Do you know what we do here at Bob's Brazilian Wax Boutique? Buy my rollerblades? <laughs> I'll tell you off the air. Bye. There he goes. Our Jacques Lemaire. Power Trip Morning Show.